Hello everybody. Welcome to English class. English with ASIN. Learn English through stories. Level A1. The White Oryx. There. Near the trees. Can you see them? They're the White Oryx of Arabia. Abdullah says very quietly. Mandy Brown takes some photos of the oryx. She is writing a book about the animals of Arabia. Today, she is in the desert with Abdullah. He is an oryx ranger. They are beautiful animals, Mandy says. But the desert is very big. How do you find them? We put little radios on the oryx, Abdullah says. You can see one there, on its neck. With the radios, we can usually find them. Suddenly, there is a noise behind them. It is the big radio in the car. The oryx look up and run away quickly. Abdullah, the radio says. Can you hear me? There's a problem in Wadi Bidbid. Perhaps poachers. I'm very near there, Abdullah says. I can go there, but I've got the Australian woman with me. That's okay, Mandy says. I can come with you. Perhaps I can help you. Okay, Abdullah says. Let's go. Mandy gets into the car and they drive away quickly across the desert. The sand makes a long yellow cloud behind the car. Poachers? Mandy asks. What do they do? They're a big problem, Abdullah says. Usually they shoot the oryx. They sell the heads. And sometimes they catch the young oryx and sell them. There's Wadi Bidbid in front of us, Abdullah says. I can't see any oryx. Let's look for tracks in the sand. They open the windows and drive slowly. Look, there, Mandy says. I can see tracks. You're right, Abdullah says. There are the tracks of a truck and some oryx. And look, there's some blood in the sand here and there. This is the work of poachers. They follow the tracks of the truck slowly across the sand. Under the tree, they find an oryx with a big hole in its neck. It is dead. We've got a problem, Abdullah says. Look, I can see the tracks of a young oryx here. This dead oryx is its mother, but the baby oryx isn't here. Can we follow the tracks of their truck in the sand? Mandy asks. Can we catch them? They drive quickly across the desert again. Mandy is watching the tracks. Abdullah is talking on the radio. One mother oryx is dead, he says, but the poachers have got her baby. We're following them. Abdullah listens to the radio and smiles. That's good, he says to Mandy. The police have a helicopter near here. They're coming too. Suddenly, they come to a road in the desert. Now they can't see the tracks of the truck. Left or right, Abdullah says. What do you think? 
Mandy climbs quickly on the car. Go to the left, she says. I can see a small cloud of sand on the left. It's the poachers. She climbs down and they follow the road to the left. Now they can see the cloud of sand behind the poachers. We're very near them now, Mandy says. Look, they're not moving. We can catch them. Oh no! There's a man with a gun near the truck. Suddenly, there is a loud noise in the car. Get down, Abdullah says quickly. They're shooting at us. Look at the hole in the window. Abdullah drives into some small trees and stops the car. He gets his gun and talks on the radio again. Mandy goes into the trees and looks at the road. The poachers are moving again, she says. They're in the truck, and the man with the gun is on the back. Are they driving away? Abdullah asks. No, Mandy says. Help! They're coming back here! Abdullah starts the car again, but it is in the sand now, and it doesn't move. He goes in front of the car with his gun. Mandy goes behind the car. Suddenly, there is a very loud noise, and they see a helicopter in front of them. It makes a big cloud of sand, and the poachers can't see the road. The truck stops in the sand, and two men run from it into the desert. The police helicopter comes down near the poachers. The poachers quickly put their guns on the sand and put up their hands. Abdullah and Mandy run to the truck. The young Oryx is in the back of the truck. There is no blood, but it isn't moving. Is it dead? Mandy asks quietly. Abdullah takes its head in his hands. The little Oryx opens its eyes and moves its legs. No, it's okay, Abdullah smiles. But its mother is dead. Mandy says. Can it live? Yes, Abdullah says. It's young, but it isn't a baby. We can find it a new mother. No problem. Wait, Mandy says suddenly. I want some photos. Mandy takes photos of Abdullah and the young Oryx. Then she takes photos of the police and their helicopter. She takes pictures of the poachers, too. A policeman comes and looks at the young Oryx. Not a bad day, the policeman says. No, Abdullah says. The mother Oryx is dead, but this young Oryx is okay, and you've got two poachers. It's a good day for me, too, Mandy smiles. I've got some very interesting pictures for my book about the animals of the desert. Perhaps you can write a new book, the policeman says. A book about the oryx poachers and the famous ranger, Abdullah. Why not? Mandy smiles again. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.